Hey Abe, it's Wednesday, September 24th, and as you can see, we are not in my dorm room. My roommate is doing homework at the moment, so I've been relegated to the study room, which is thankfully empty. So there's something that's pretty common, at least in our family, is to claim to not like something and actually like it, but like not acknowledge it. You fool yourself into thinking you don't like it for whatever reason. And you legitimately believe it. You think that it is something that's true about you, but in reality it isn't. So for instance, our dad, he thinks he doesn't like hot fruit. He eats all sorts of pies and things, and he likes them. But until recently, it didn't sort of connect with him that they were equivalent that, yes, he does like hot fruit. Our mom is similar to me in this respect in that she thinks she doesn't like gore in, like, movies and television shows. She doesn't like violence. She doesn't like gore. And then she falls in love with all of these cop shows. She got us all into Bones, and that is one of the goriest shows I've ever seen. Maggots and stuff. It's fantastic, and she loves it. And she is also having to reconcile, I don't like this, but I actually do. So my thing with that is that I don't think that I like superheroes. And let me tell you something, that's a lie. Now, I, I believed this very strongly for many years. I don't really, I can't really tell you why. Because when I was in elementary school, I had a big Wonder Woman phase. Like, it was my favorite thing. I read so much Wonder Woman in just like one year. I was like in fifth grade or something. I was super into it. And then after that, I just, I fell off of it. I remember being, I don't want to watch the Spider-Man movie. And then you and Daddy were like, well, we're going to watch the Spider-Man movie, so you can either sit through it or not. And then I did. And I loved it. But I still didn't think I liked superheroes. It was just like, okay, that was a decent movie. That was a solid movie. We can live with that. And I've still not seen the Hulk. Like, you've tried to convince me to watch the Hulk. And it's just, I don't like superheroes. I'm not going to watch the Hulk. But I loved X-Men. I have a similar thing with the X-Men. I didn't want to watch the X-Men. Why was I going to watch the X-Men? It was a superhero movie. And then I watched it, and it was fantastic. And then I watched all the sequels. Well, most of the sequels. A lot of the sequels. So then I didn't watch the Avengers. And then Tumblr exploded with the Avengers. We fell in love. Everybody I knew was talking about it, and it took me a full year to watch it. And I really liked it. And I didn't want to, but I did. It was great. It was funny, and the action was not too long to be boring. But I didn't like superheroes. It was just Joss Whedon, Whedon wrote it. That's that's why I liked it. Joss Whedon wrote it. I like the things that Joss Whedon writes. And Buffy is totally not a superhero. No, 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 not me. I wouldn't watch a superhero TV show. <laughs> and then, your friend Evan made me watch Captain America. And I liked it. And then, in my physics class, I watched Iron Man. And I liked it. And then also in physics class, I watched Iron Man 2. And it was a sequel, and... It was a superhero movie, and I liked it. Long story short, I saw The Winter Soldier really recently, and it was amazing. And I really liked it. And I think that I might be giving up. Because the fact of the matter is, superhero movies are fun. And recently, a lot of them have fantastic characterization. And Captain America isn't at all who I thought he would be. Oh my goodness, I thought he would be a big propaganda machine, and then he's not. And he's questioning authority, and is like, morally righteous, and just, like, <laughs> I'm sorry to fangirl. I'm giving up. I like superheroes. And I'm gonna try to start reading comics. Like, get the source material. I've got friends who read comics, and I've got, there's apparently a decent section in our library. I'm gonna look them up. And this is kind of causing me a minor identity crisis. Because I don't like superheroes. Superheroes and superhero movies, they have gratuitous fight scenes and hollow female love interests that don't advance the plot and they have badly articulated characters and they have just like stupid, 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 stupid. Except for that, that's a lie. I'll see you on Saturday.